In today's video, we're going to discuss about lateral surface area, couch surface area and total surface area. And we will try to find out the difference between these three. So let's understand. So what is the difference between lateral surface area and couch surface area? Let's see this one first. Let me give you an example. Let's suppose that I have this prism. This is a square prism. And this part is we can say the top, right? And this one is the bottom or we can say the base. Now, if I cannot consider the top and the bottom or the base, and I only consider these four sides, right? So that is called the lateral surface area. Lateral surface area is nothing, but whenever we are not considering the top and the bottom, that is called the lateral surface area. So in this case, we are not considering top and the base. So whenever we have to find the surface area of the sides only, we will say that that is the lateral surface area. Now what is couch surface area? So lateral surface area and couch surface area, you can understand it both are similar. But what is the difference? So in the couch surface area, we consider this curve. If you see here, this is the curve, right? In the curve shape. So if you need to find the surface area of this curve, you can say that is a couch surface area. So curve is available in the cylinder cone, but it is not available in the square prism because in the square prism, we have the sides, right? So we can say it's a lateral surface area. Lateral means sides. Here we can say that code is available. So code surface area is same. Whenever we need to find the code surface area, it means we have to remove the top and the bottom and we only need to find the code surface area. I hope you understand the difference between lateral surface area and code surface area. Now last thing is, what is total surface area? So total surface area is Whenever we are considering top and bottom, top and bottom, as well as this lateral part, that is called the total surface area. So total surface area is when we are considering all these things, top, bottom and couch surface area, or we can say that top, base and this lateral part. So that time we can say this is the total surface area. But when we are only considering this part and not considering the top and the base we call its lateral surface area or curved surface area i hope you understand the difference between these three thank you very much for watching this video to book your one-on-one -on -one tutoring session you can contact us via call email or whatsapp please do not pay anything before you get confirmation of your time and date Thank you for your cooperation. We appreciate your patience. See you in the next video.